Did Todrick Hall actually pretend to buy his dream home and even do a YouTube tour of it, but actually he was only renting it and now he's getting sued because he hasn't even paid the rent? Well, according to TMZ, that's exactly what's happening. TMZ says that Todrick is being sued by a Sherman Oaks landlord for failure to pay $60,000 in back rent. The suit claims that Todrick is supposed to pay $30,000 a month in rent, but is now 60 days behind. Why does this man always have money problems? Now, not only did Todrick post a video on his own YouTube and ask his viewers for their decorating comments, he took those comments in hand and made a special Wizard of Oz room, which looks beautiful, and then showcased it on MTV Cribs as his own house. And just so there's no confusion, Todrick did post on January 26, 2021, I am officially a homeowner, so it's not like he was kind of renting but not saying anything, like when James Charles had his other house, everybody thought he owned it, but he was renting, but he never said he owned it. And in another post from February 2021, Todrick speaks on how meaningful it is to him to now be a homeowner. He said he never had a home growing up. He wasn't homeless, but he bounced around from city to city. He's never had a place to call his own. Todrick continues and explains that he's experienced so much heartache and betrayal and he's seen a side of humanity that he never would experience. But when he got the key to his dream home, he officially changed the legacy of the Hall family and they now have generational wealth. His children will have a place to grow and become familiar with. It's a very hard story because he's talking like he owns the house, but TMZ is saying he doesn't own the house. So I need more information, you guys. I did reach out to Todrick for a comment because I did want to be fair in this story because it's so hard for me to believe. He hasn't responded, but I mean, I wasn't really expecting Todrick Hall to check his Instagram DMs and respond to one from me, but that was the only way I could think of getting in touch with him. I really would like to hear his side of the story because this is just nuts. I mean, I don't I don't know what else to say. It's It's a very strange story. In the past, as I'm sure a lot of people know, Todrick has been charged with not paying his dancers, and there have been other allegations of financial issues. So that being said, I guess I will try to get my hands on the court documents and see what Todrick files in his answer. I would like to see if he's facing eviction because he's got a lot of personal stuff in there, a lot of expensive stuff. That's going to be a real pain to move, especially when he is on tour. So hopefully if he is renting, he can get caught up. And Todrick's friends with everybody. Of course, he's worked with Taylor Swift. As I mentioned, he's on tour right now, and he just had the young dancers of Beyond Belief dance. That's Alyssa Edwards, the drag queen's dance team, open for him in Texas. And of course, my first thought was, did the little girls get paid? But also, that's what makes this story so tough, is that people in the industry love Todrick, and they respect him. And even though there's always drama, people are still willing to work with him. All right, now it's your turn. Let me know in the comments, how do you feel about Todrick Hall? Do you think that it's okay to lie and pretend that you have a house and go on MTV? Or do you think that possibly he does own the house and maybe he was in a rent to own situation? He just was in all that drama after Big Brother and things had finally calmed down and he was just going out on tour and now this is kicked off. So is this one drama story too many or will Todrick Hall once again sail past? And last, but most certainly not least, would you pay $30,000 a month in rent for a house? I don't care how nice the house is. $30,000 a month for a year, that's $360,000. And you can buy a pretty nice house in most of America for that amount. Maybe two years rent, you'd get a, an amazing house. No, that's to me, that's just a waste of money. So anyway, those are my thoughts. Let me know yours in the comments. And don't forget to like the video, subscribe, and I'll see you very soon with another video. And also check me out on TikTok for more Todrick T on there. I'll put the link in the description.